Ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to another Minecraft Pocketition Let's Play video. Hey, how you doing down there, zombie? You know, you're gonna burn. You should just stay in the water. Go for a little swim today. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> we'll just let that zombie be. So, we're going on to the... Hello there, spider. You're just spinning around doing a little dance. Yeah. All, all, the, all, the, all the monsters are out. But yeah, we're in Duckman77 to the viewer appreciation wall today because... Oh, oh, okay, okay, hey, 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 spider. Because he commented on one of my videos and he was a great subscriber. So, yeah. So, thank you, thank you, dude. And yeah, thanks for watching. How, how are you doing up there, spider? I'm give you a little high five. No? doesn't want a high five. But today, we're not really going to be leaving the house. We have some building, not really building, but house stuff to do. And yeah. And uh, this stuff is from a creeper that blew up at the fun land over there. So yeah, I need to sort him out. I'm just going to put all my rubbish in this chest. But yeah. So we got some materials up here and the reason we have these specific materials is because we are doing our um, brewing and enchanting room and more stuff up here today so yeah these are the materials obviously you need for your uh, brewing stand you need your three cobblestone and a blaze rod and for the enchantment table I believe it's four obsidian two diamonds and a and I'm actually just going to put away everything I really don't need, which is actually I have everything I need on me, don't I? Okay, brewing stand and enchantment table. So, yeah, we made those. So, I think how we're going to do it... I don't have the bookshelves I need yet, so we're going to put... But we're going to put the bookshelf sort of here, 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 here. Uh, here and there, so that will sort of be that area. But then on the other side of the bookshelf, so we're going to make a little counter. We're going to have um, some water, sort of a little cauldron type thing, and our brewing stand. And so, yeah, we need to head downstairs and get some materials that we want to build this counter out of. I think we could do some stone slabs like the one we have on the floor here, maybe, or some other stone slabs. We'll see what we've got. We could do some obsidian, that would look pretty cool. Maybe we should do some obsidian. What other cool bricks have we got that we could do it out of? Anything? I think we're going to do it out of... Let's just do it out of obsidian. That will look pretty cool. And actually, we need a, a bucket of water so we can... Do we have a bucket of water? Yes, we do. So we can have that as like a cauldron type thing. For filling up the water bottles for when we are doing such stuff like brewing. So, yep. We are do all the obsidian along like this. I think. Oh no, we're going to need to put our water. So we put our water back here. That means, let me get my pickaxe out. We get rid of this. And then we can put our water in there. Okay. And then we can just put our brewing stand along here somewhere. Where should we put that? Um, should we make... Well, we'll need another blaze rod if we need to make another one. We'll put that down there. Look at that. Look at the brewing stand. It looks so amazing. Looks pretty cool. And we'll actually put some soul sand here, actually, I think is what we should do, because we need to grab some, put some nether wart on that to uh, make the potions in the first place. And I don't have any nether wart on me right now, so I'll have to go back into the nether, nether soon and grab some of that. So let's just hope that the water doesn't spill out. Oh, 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 no, oh, no, oh, no, where did that, where did that go? Oh, there it went. There it goes. So, yeah, that's sort of what this is going to look like. So we grab some uh, glass, we can make some glass bottles, and then we can put those on the, uh, the brewing stand. 
Do we have any glass in here anywhere? I really need to organize this. This is an absolute mess. I should probably do that out of episode. That's going to be my challenge, is by the next episode, this will all be uh, looking organized. Organized looking. Uh, let's mm, cook some more glass, though. Don't we have any down here? Do we? No. And we're also going to take that magma cream upstairs. We can take all of this stuff that we don't... Mm, uh, that is especially for brewing or you know, enchanting and stuff like that, and put that upstairs. Grab some coal for the furnace here, and we'll cook that all up. So what we need to do now is go out and find some cows, because we need uh, some leather for the books, so that we can enchant some books and make some bookcases. I don't see any cows though. Cows. Where are the cows gone? They can't have heard that I was coming to kill them all that quickly. Um, cows, I'm actually not coming to kill you. I'm actually just coming to throw a party for you. So if you all just want to, or every single cow in this world just wants to turn up, then, um, yeah. How you doing, sheep? How you doing? Any cows? Any cows? Any cows? Oh, there's an endermen over there. Let's go. Say hi to the Enderman. We do have a uh, sharpness one sword, so we should be able to take this guy on. I heard the uh, the trick is just to look at the feet of the Enderman, just like look straight down his legs and hit him at the legs. Okay, Enderman, uh, don't be glitching on me. Don't be, don't be teleporting on me now. Hi there, how you doing, buddy? Hi, how you doing? Oh, okay. Um, oh no. Um, okay, that was pretty easy actually. Um, you might have noticed my skins changed. We are playing as the uh, the leader of the 501st Captain Rex. So, yeah. Um, oops, okay. We could probably do on eating some of this melon. Do we have any cows in our old farm? We could go have a check. I don't think we do. I think I would have seen them had them known about them if I did. So I don't think there is, but maybe we can we can take a little adventure back here. We don't usually head back head over here any much these days. Oops, okay, okay. Oh there is a cow in here. Hi, how you doing? How you doing cow? Ooh, two leather. Thank you very much, cow. You were very generous. I sh probably should have bred some cows so we can have more cows but there you go that's my smart for everyone out there and this small d-pad is not working out I tried to um, minimize the size of the d-pad just so it wouldn't interfere with the amount of uh, the screen that you guys could see so yeah it's just a bit harder to control that way oh there's another cow that's, oh there's a baby nearby. Baby? Um, you know what? Um, there we go, I just did it. Yeah, yeah, you can just walk away, nothing happened. You didn't see anything. So I got four leather now, that is absolutely great. So that means we can make some four books, something like that. I know the portal, how are you doing? I'm not gonna go in there. Oh. Oh, there's a creeper though. Oh, 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 there's like five creepers. What the, what? Oh no, and a baby zombie villager. What is this? Uh, I'm just going to take a screenshot of that. Oh no, oh my gosh. Oh, oh no, oh no. Oh, oh my gosh. i got to kill this guy. Oh no. Oh my gosh. Oh no, oh, just. Well, oh, what is that? Is that a zombie with a shovel? Oh, come here, zombie. I want your shovel. Can I get your shovel? Oh man, I didn't get a shovel. Oh man. That would have been sweet if I'd gotten a shovel. Oh my gosh, how many blimmin' monsters are there over here? Ow. That was not good. There were like three creepers and that baby zombie priest villager and... 
That was intense. Very, very intense. Let's, uh, look, uh, let's go over here. It's getting night time, so there's going to be even more baddies, which is not going to be very good. Let's take a look over here, see if there's any cows at all that may be of any use to us. Any, any cows out here? Oh my gosh, I just noticed my, my hunger has been dropping significantly. Lots of melon must be eaten to replenish it. Replenish it all. Okay, there we go. Now we can sprint home. Let's just take a little dive. Fill up the water bucket there. Whee! Oh. I almost made that jump. We're not far from being able to do some long, long range parkour. If we had a potion of swiftness we could we could do with just that. Let's um so let's head back uh back in here. It looks like there it the wall has not uh was not um loaded in completely, so we saw there's a skeleton over there. How you doing? Garden. I know you're over there. Okay. It's a bit creepy. But let's... I'm pretty sure we had some paper somewhere. Yes, we did. Let's go and craft some books. And do we have any wood? I don't think we do. I think we have to go downstairs and grab some wood. So we can make a one bookcase. I'm going to work hard and get some more bookcases out of episode lots of stuff I have to do out of episode because it's probably not very entertaining to, entertaining to see me just make bookcases but what's, what's going wrong is it go, is something going wrong that I'm, I'm trying to grab some wood here and actually I do remember we have glass to pick up here and you know, um, you know what actually let's cook some of this and we can put some of the stuff we don't need away. Looks like some of these chests are awfully full. Let's see, looks like we can manage to fit some of the stuff in here. Do we have a chest with any rotten flesh in? Probably. Oh, there's some leather in there. That's great. And we can replace that with some rotten flesh make another book and one bookcase and the glass bottles that we need oh let's actually um oh I make glass panes that I did not need to make 16 glass panes but I did it anyway let's pop those oh that no not the micro cream well, let's put those in there and we can put the rest of this obsidian away so yeah let's jump back upstairs to this area here and I sort of like how this is looking this is looking pretty good here so let's uh, start off with the, with these bookcases we'll put that one there and let's see if I can actually enchant my um, my leggings and I think we're gonna need some lapis lazuli for this so let's jump on downstairs and grab some of that I'm pretty sure we have some in one of these chests somewhere let's have a little look here oh, oh no no not in that chest no no what about this chest yes there's two there we've got any more I don't think we do but two might be enough see if we can get any good enchantment on our leggings maybe a protection or something to help us when battling those creepers we've got projectile protection too protection one and blast protection let's take blast protection because when we're encountering those creepers I don't think we need to be uh, needing any of that efficiency just efficiency one we could get efficiency one on our shovel or oh, what have we got here bane of arthropods on a uh, on an axe don't think we need that what can we got on this I think efficiency efficiency let's enchant our pickaxe with Efficiency, or we can chant one of these books. Sharpness, we don't really need any books, those need to be used for bookcases. So let's efficiency up the pickaxe, like so. Pick that back up. We also have these books away in here with the rest of that paper. And yeah, we can now 
have a full enchanted diamond armor with enchanted diamond sword. Let's actually lay this out properly here. We're gonna have the pickaxe here, you gotta have the axe. Uh axe. Then shovel there, then bow, then your arrows, and then your food. That is how to have the best layout of inventory. That's how it's that's how it's gotta look. I mean it just makes it accessible to every tool that you really need. See we've got the nice animations now and switching your items from your different inventory slots. But yeah. It looks like it is time for us to pop into bed here. Take a little nap. And yeah. So this is how it's looking right now. We got our brewing area, anvil area, stuff like that. So yeah. Now we have one more thing which I want to do in this episode, which is create a mushroom house. And it really should have been night time for that. Hmm, how am I gonna figure I think I know how I can do that? How am I gonna create a mushroom house? Let actually because I was gonna create a mushroom house for any visitors that you know are ever coming into the world, you know. I do have the guest bedroom, but I was thinking um why don't we make a nice little sort of house for them all to take a little nap in? Well, yeah. That's what this uh, is going to be for. We're going to grab some of this. We have any bones? We really need some bone meal. And let's see if we can find any skeletons or burning bones from skeletons. Because that will just make growing this a lot easier. We did see one over here. Let's see if his bones are here. Like, Oh, Enderman, are you just stealing from the sheep? The poor sheep. You're just going to steal from them. Really, Enderman. I'm... Here's a skeleton. Oh, here's a... Oh! Okay, here is a skeleton army. Let's duck behind here. Are they going to fire at me? Oh, they are. Oh, wow, they have some good aim. Good aim. Okay. Actually, you know what? Um, Yeah, thank you. I'm actually going to take them out with a bit of bow skill myself. Oh my gosh. I've just realized. Look at the enchantment on this bow. Look when. Look at just the, the sparkles on the bow. Yes, it's so sparkly. Oh. Two down, I wanna go. Oh, oh that's a that's a great hit. Oh no, Enderman. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, mate. Oh no. Oh I've just in I've just angered an, an Enderman. Oh that can't be good. Look at all the skeleton loot down here though, all the experience. Let's see if we can get to level ten. Maybe. Oh close, close, close. But we got the bones we need so we can grow our little um Oh, hi Enderman. Um I'm your friend, right? Oh no, okay. We're gonna battle it out. There we go, we got to level ten. So we're gonna pop this mushroom down here. Actually we can't do that, can we? So it's gonna have to be dark wherever we go. So I'm gonna wait for it to be night time and and you will see me when it is night time right now. Okay guys, so I just realized that I had 31 lapis just chilling up here. And I'm 10 levels, so what I enchant some more stuff. So we can enchant this thing. Ooh, do want unbreaking? Efficiency. Efficiency will be more efficient. And considering it's a diamond axe, I think it's going to be pretty unbreakable anyway. So, efficiency, efficiency, unbreaking. Efficiency, yeah, let's just go with efficiency. One on that. Do we have anything we can? Oh, I just had a genius idea. I just had a genius idea. I know what I really want to enchant. And you know what? Who cares? We'll make this a longer episode to make up for the short one yesterday. Hmm, where is it? Oh, here. A fishing rod. So, yeah, we're going to enchant a fishing rod. See if we can get an amazing enchantment on this, like, luck of the sea or lure of the sea, whatever it is. Because then we can pull up enchanted books 
on our fishing rod, which is going to be pretty cool. I might also enchant my shears and my uh, thing. But let's see. Um, do I not have enough levels? I have eight levels. Why can I not enchant this? And what? Can I not enchant shears? No. Craft bad combination. Is it? Be no, it can't be because I've already used it. Hmm. Maybe I don't have enough levels. But I should. Can one of you guys explain it to me why I can't enchant my beautiful fishing rod? I uh, okay, I'll put on all the ingredients. Bad combination. Really? Okay. I guess I cannot enchant my fishing rod. What a tragedy, what a tragedy. Ooh, glistering melons. Do we actually, how many gold nuggets? Let's make some glistering me melons and golden carrots. We should totally do that. That would be pretty cool for some amazing potions. And it should be easy considering, yeah, we can just take one of these and make it into plenty of these. Let's make... Oh, do we have a carrot? Oh, we don't have enough of the little gold ingot things. We should have one here. And we have a gold block in here, so, yeah, forget it. And we can make a carrot. Look at this. So we now have the golden carrot and the glistering melon. Can we eat either of these? No, I don't think we can. Or is it because we're not hungry? Let's try and get a bit hungry here. See if we can eat these. Although I don't think you can. I think they're just for uh, brewing. So we'll put them up in here, this chest here. Along with magma cream, which we're going to put in there. And is it going to become nighttime soon? Where does the sun appear to be in the sky? It appears to be going down, so we can make a mushroom house very, very soon. So yeah, this might go be a half an hour episode. I like the sound of that, I like the sound of that. Considering yesterday was like 11 minutes or something, so yeah, it was a short one. I've just found another six, six le leather, so we can make another six books makes more bookcases we are being very productive in this episode okay one one thing we are we are being very productive and and the sprint is just making me even more productive it's just amazing books 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 i think we're gonna run out of paper actually yeah we have enough to make a few more um uh books actually enough leather so let's see let's go to the sugarcane farm grab some sugarcane and we can cut down a tree because we're gonna need some wood for the wonderful um bookcases and we can just you know finish off the enchantment room a bit more looks like we have some sugarcane that's grown up over here which means we should be able to get plenty more paper any of it go in the water? No, no. Okay, we are good. So let's. Hi, Mr. Sheep. How you doing? Hi, Mr. Sheep. How you doing? Would you like a carrot? Yeah. There you go. No, you don't want my carrot. Okay, I'll I'll take them. That that's cool. Just you know, do a little jumping over here. Hi, chicken. How you doing? No. Okay. Let's try out this efficiency. See how fast this goes. Oh my gosh, this is literally far, like, I'm in creative. It's, this is wonderful. Look at this axe. Oh, oh. It was so fast that, like, Minecraft just couldn't keep, what? What the what? Why, why does everything keep glitching? Oh my gosh, okay. That was very scary. It was like a jump scare. Okay, let's get back to the house because it is night time we can make our mushroom tree. So we're going to do that. Mushroom tree house. How you doing there, Mr. Mr. Chicken? That's what you are. You're a chicken. 
Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, let's just climb up here if we can. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Oops, okay. It's gotten very laggy all, all of a sudden, but that does not matter. We're going to make some of this bone meal, and we're going to take out our mushrooms, and we're going to take out our bone meal, and we're going to make ourselves little mushroom trees. Let's sort of clear the uh, area here. Whoop. Just, yeah, destroy all this grass here. There we go, so we can plant this little tree down here, and let's bone meal it up. And looks like we have one. Look at that. It looks super magical. So we're going to run inside. We actually just need some slabs. Is all we need now. And we should be able to uh, make some with the wood we just collected. So let's go into a rafting table here. Let's make all this into uh, some of that into some of those. And we've got six. One, two, well, okay. That will be that will suffice for now so yeah this is a very cool mushroom house I really don't want to accidentally break any of these mushroom blocks because we can't get them back if we lose them like if we destroy them we will not get the block so yeah we got some ladders here so someone can get up into the treehouse and look at that we could put a bed up here you know could, someone could have a little sleep but yeah that's gonna be it except for the bookcases we have to make actually aren't they we'll finish that off and that will be the end of the episode here bam another two bookshelves okay let's pop in how many books do we have we have no books I see so it's been a very productive and long episode today so yeah thank you guys for watching and sticking with me through the entire episode unless you didn't watch the entire episode yeah okay but yeah look at this can I enchant my uh, thingy now no okay but yeah in the next episode, we will explore, do something cool, something like that. I think we are going to go mining in the next episode. That is the plan right now. Anyway, so yeah. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!